What is going on everyone and welcome back to some more Fire Emblem Three Houses and well we're gonna end the day hey. I've done everything I needed to do off camera I realized what we really need is more money so we're gonna take steps to do that But first, Claude with his new class. Um, hmm. If I had to choose. Oh, wait, I wrote some notes down. Hang on. Okay, so I said I want Leone to get more authority. Ah, okay. This will be useful. But I want the next level. I've learned a lot. I've learned a lot. Okay. I also want to rank work on Hil um Flames rank. And hmm. I guess if Flame could get more magic before the next battle cuz I'm pretty sure since it is the battle it is. I have done it. I'm bringing Flame. Okay. I also wanted Hilda to get a higher gambit. She's stuck at D. And that's all that I wrote for the notes as far as what I want to really work on. So in that case, Lawrence. Darn it, so close. Um, Marianne. Well, I guess we can come back to Marianne because she's not the most important because she's already a master class. I'm not sure if I'm going to bring Shamir on this next battle. Yeah, I'm not sure at all about that. Um, well, there's always Claude. That's a solid choice. And, hmm. Well, Claude, what do I want? You probably won't get your bows up in time for next battle. So... Maybe you can get a new combat art from your sword. Nope. Good fuel for a scheme. It's worth the shot. And I guess just pump more into his bows. That was easy, thanks to you. Last one. Well, Marianne, if you could get I'd say more magic. But, no. Although, who's really left? I mean, Raph is fine. Let's see if we can get Raph a better gambit. C plus. I'm feeling good about this. I think I'm starting to get it. All right. Pretty sure the goals are where I want them to be, so let's begin. Uh, Professor, I've something I'd like to ask you. Okay. Nothing. When I do nothing but fight, my spirits falter and I lose the will to keep things tidy. Um. Hmm. What a superior answer. Okay. And no supports, at least not with me. I'm glad it's you. I welcome your assistance. Huh. Well, Professor, impressed? I wonder if that was due to their rank. This should be suitable. Oh, really? Well, that'll help. Wow, nobody. Oh, Shamir's at C, and Cyril got I'm B. I'm finding my focus. Yeah, I understand now. Okay. Hmm. 
Lawrence, did you make it? Maybe. 66. If I had a master seal, I'd try it. But I do not. So we'll wait. Um, yeah, well, well, Shamir also. Ooh. Wait, no. 33! No. That's, that's not acceptable. Okay. Well, what I'm gonna do now is we're gonna battle. Not that. Um... We're gonna do these two. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, yeah, where is this? This isn't what I thought it was. Or is it? Yes, it is. It's just from a different angle. Okay. Claude. I can't look at it right now. Well, we got plenty of brawlers, so that's time to do what I want. I already checked out who I wanted um, for these. Hilda, as always, you take Seta. Claude, I really would like you to... Well, the ironic thing is, now I feel like I need to change his class because Claude can't support with anybody I need him to unless his class has changed. I was gonna take Flane and yeah, I'll have to change Claude's class. That's annoying. Oh, I can, no, I can do Ingrid for this one. We'll do Ingrid because this guy has a new class and I might end up leveling that up all the way. Whoa, this dude's looking serious? Huh. Interesting, and then Claude's new class. Wow. Alrighty then. Wait, let me look at the wings again. Wonder what made him choose that? Maybe his heritage? But okay. Oh, Milda leveled up to 35. Ugh. Quite what I'd hoped for. Yeah. Oh, and Sadith leveled up to 27. Had I room to grow? See, he has plenty of strength to spare. Oh, and there's him when he's not on his right. It looks cool. It looks cool. One of the others have gone through two different transformations. It's good to fight for a cause. Shamir leveled up to 33. Okay. More effective. Now there's a way forward. Ooh, Marianne's level 36. Jeez. I want to learn even more. I'll defeat you. I can do this. And there's a rare two crit from Ignat. I'm about to let you go. Followed by a level up. Okay. Got to pull it together. It's all right. Really tough. Raphael leveled up thirty three. Gotta get stronger. Wow. <laughs> Had to use my special on this guy. I must lead them well. He's powerful. Sorry, but I must. Uh, well, that didn't go as planned. They were too tough for me to fight. I have to take it seriously. Any supports? Nope. None of that. Cloud got one with Shamir, not the intended target, but okay. Hilda, nope, so okay, we'll keep the same setup. Okay, when they said enemies, I thought they meant enemies. Nah, this was the Empire? I thought this was Alliance territory. 
Huh. Okay. Um, I don't really see a good chance to uh, grind here either for supports. Let's see Hilda use Thoron for fun. <laughs> That's interesting. Shamir is level 34. Not what I was hoping for. But for two yeah, stats. Incredible. That was those are two good stats to get. Hold the grudge if you must. Oh, here's a crit. And his master class. You got yourself killed. 99. Leonie's 35. I got cocky. Ah, uh, not what I wanted. Claude's 35. Okay. I'm that much closer to my goal. Hengrid's level 27. Hey. For now, I'll revel in my achievement. More than she could actually be battle ready. Lawrence is 35. I can exceed this. Turn the tides. And I'm level 35. There is still room for improvement. That's a good one. What's with the money we're getting? Hmm. All right, let's instruct. There's not much to do, I don't think. Lysithia. Really just work on your magic. Easier than I thought. Okay. Marianne, if we can get some more of your magic. I managed to get it. Wow. I managed to get it. Maybe I've grown. Because I haven't been able to work directly on that since I've been working on her class change. Should we already work on you? Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Well. More writing, I guess? Let's do this again. Um, Cyril. Bo. I could have kept going. Who else? Um, Seth. I mean, you can get your sword ranked to C. That'd be cool. Hopefully, this proves useful. And more of this. Two more. Well, hmm. Guess Catherine will work on your swords. That was tough. Critique. You're right. I'll get it next time. Thank you for teaching me. And Hammond, I'm with you. Uh, hmm. Guess just more magic? That was rather productive. Okay. And begin training. Now here we go. Oh. Cyril! Keeping it clean, sweeping it clean, no more trash, nowhere, no how. <laughs> what? Oh darn, there's trash over there. Oh darn. Yeah? Hey, Professor, the cathedral's a real important place for the Church of Saros, so I always make sure it's all sparkling clean. The monks do some cleaning too, and they tell me not to bother, and sometimes they even say to go away, but they just don't clean as good as I do. Uh, all right. I don't stop until everything shines. 
Yeah, I mean, of course. Nah, not really. Oh, wait, really? And Lady Rhea told me it's okay if I don't show an interest unless I feel like it. And I haven't so far, but... So, Rhea took him in and says it's okay for him not to be a believer? And Edelgard try Wait, no, I'm gonna need... Like, the more I hear about it, like... Rhea only gets upset by people who denounce Sothis. But for people who say, ah, I'm not really a believer, she's like, okay, well, that's fine. You're still a person, still gonna help you. The more I find out about Rhea, I'm like, I'm leaning more and more to that she, I, <sighs> she's done some suspect stuff with myself, of course, but there may be a legitimate reason considering what happened with Edelgard. I don't know. But I'm sure gonna find out when I'm ready to find out when I meet her. I just want to take good care of the things she cares about. If there's a thing she wants taken care of, then I'll do it better than anyone else. Don't you feel the same? Since Lady Rhea really took a liking to you and all. Well, I will say that. Maybe you don't realize how great a person Lady Rhea is. I do, but literally, like, I'm leading this whole operation, Cyril. She's always praying hard as she can for her followers all across Fodlin. She does it every single day. And even though she's always so busy, she tries to listen to as many people's needs as she can. That is true, though. When she seen the kids who lost their parents in Remire Village, she didn't leave them there. She got the church to take those kids in. Same as me. Yeah, I remember. She's so kind. She's almost like a mom to all her followers, and just everybody that I can think of loves her. Hmm. Hang on. You trying to say you know more about Lady Rhea than I do? Well, possibly. Yeah, probably do. Okay, maybe she likes you more than she likes me. I didn't say that. But I know that I know a whole lot more about her than you do. I know these things, okay? So don't go talking down to me like you know better. Yeah? Huh? Well, just as long as we're all clear on that. Huh, I'm actually interested to see what his A rank is all about. And that'll help. But more importantly... What is this gonna be about? Ooh, that's it? Oh man, I was hoping to make me some event or something, but I got a letter. That wasn't so bad. Well, I'll take it. Ignatz is at C. <laughs> Bernadette is now at A. Flame, you still got a ways to go. Okay. I got the gist of it now. Dexterity? I'd never have learned this back in my room. Enclosure? I always was a quick study. Reason level three? Okay. Well, there's only one thing that really makes sense this time is to rest. Um. Marianne, where are you as far as, uh, 51? What do you need? Why you, Why just 51? Oh, no. Huh, just writing? Same as Lawrence, right? Uh... Is this writing level higher? His is... Oh, B! Really? Oh yeah, well that's definitely higher. Okay. Um and Ignatz. Yeah, still a ways to go. It's not even on the boat on the board. What do you need? You still need more Lance too. Um and Jameer. I think yours is just writing, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I wanted to go into the market, but... Especially since I used my sword of the creator. 
I guess combat arts with that. All right, let's instruct. Who's the most important? I mean, Lawrence's Gambit doesn't really matter. I'm not switching it out right now. I don't, I, oh, Hilda, let's try to get your. I didn't even know I cared this much. Oh, darn it. Yeah, who's the best? I'm the best. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Marianne. We're currently still working on writing and just writing, right? I can help it along, but it won't be ready in time for the next battle. That was nice. Uh, Lysithia, just, you're fine. You won't be ready in time either. I mean, I guess we should do Cyril. Okay. Yeah, I understand now. Oh! This is probably why he's not performing. I kept going. I got it? Nice! I knew I could get it. Yeah, I understand now. Gambits make a huge difference. Okay, now he can use one of the D's that somebody else left over. Flane, Flane. I failed. Professor, I will work harder. She's not good at that though. I might make Flane a Grimmery. That was another thing I was thinking about. I can try to get your gambits up, uh, Lawrence, but like, well, that won't really do much. Maybe you'll get a new magic in the midst of battle? I kind of doubt it, though. Let's just keep on working on this. This was hardly a challenge for me. That was adequate. Okay. Ignatz. I feel like I wasted so much time trying to pump him in the magic. I can't believe I got it wrong. I'll do better next time. Nope. Okay. Um. Hmm. Leone, your spears. Or lances. There we go. Lance jab. Let's see it in action. Yeah. Hopefully it's good. Um, so we'll do that. Goals. Think I'm pretty much still happy with where everyone Do reason in writing. That makes a lot more sense. Well, Professor, impressed? They're both at 104. This is the last one before the big battle. Darn it. Marianne was so close. Nothing really. I didn't even know I cared this much. Nosferatu. Okay. Hexblade. Okay. Well, I think a master seal is in order. So, of the people who are needing of a new class, it's Lawrence, Ignatz, Marianne. Oh. And flame. I have succeeded. All right, well, 
it's finally time to get her in her class uniform. Huh. Why is it that color, though? All right. But, um, all right, so that's that. And I should get another one. Whoever has the best chances. So, certifications. I'll leave Shamir for right now. I'm not sure if she'll even be in that battle. Which leaves... Marianne's already in a master class. The priority, I think, is either Lawrence or Ignatz. So, that leaves Lawrence. Let's see. It's got 66 chance for... 66... Darn it, that's a failure. Alright. There must be some mistake. Well, I knew that going in. Had to try though. We can make ourselves just that much stronger. We're saving that up. And we do have oh you yeah. Flame, what the heck? What the heck, Flame? Alright, what did Claude give me this? Wait, really? Huh. Didn't realize that. That's interesting. That's it! Yo, I low-key want to sell that. How much, how much that go for the market? Uh, yeah, uh, if I want to sell, um... Well, first off, I can't. Well, you can't sell a gift. Not that I don't appreciate it, but like, come on, Claude. I need something else than that. Well, I can use it to do foraging and stuff like that. Well, when considering what's the best for us right now, Obviously, it's not rest. So, let me see. Okay. I disabled that. I was just curious. Oh, wait. Mary Ann can do a seminar. That's actually quite interesting. Wish you could uh, switch what you, uh, or who attends the seminar. Being a, begin a seminar worthy of a genius that will have participants reconsidering everything they thought they knew about magic. Well, that's fitting. Well, I mean, I already did the certification, so it wouldn't really matter, would it? The only thing I think I worried about is magic. And as far as that goes... Okay, honestly, if Marianne could get more reason, that'd be cool. But with the amount she has left, I could probably just get that in battle and she'll gain her magic. Everyone else? No. No seminar then. So that leaves battle and explore. If I go to explore, there is a bitter eats thing. And if I go to battle, it's the same dadgum battles I already did. And what what do we need to we need to be at level 33 for the mission? Oh yeah, what's Claude's letter? <laughs> okay. Um what can I do with that? Do I give it to him? I guess then the last thing I should do is explore. No, it's not a what do I do with it then? Hmm, I guess I just keep it. Let's see what we got on the bitter eats. Flane, good. And Mary, no, these two. That smell, mm, it's amazing. My fave, in fact. Do you like it too? This is nearly as delicious as mother's cooking. 
I would happily eat this every day. Okay. Did that work? Well, it's about time, Flane. Thank goodness. Maybe that'll help. Uh, as far as cooking, do we really need anything? HP and strength, do we have that? No, we don't. Heck, the battle is coming up is such a big deal, I might do that. But first, well. let's get these supports underway. Ooh, Claude. Got a lot of supports. Uh, we'll start with this one. Ah, hello, Ingrid. A good day to you. Wow, okay, this is his attempt. Well, hello there. If it isn't Claude, always a pleasure. These two are a trip. You put in a fine performance in training today. <laughs> I must redouble my own efforts. Wow. <laughs> uh, <laughs> nah, that sounds so fake. That's kind of you to say. By the by, do you have a moment to spare? <laughs> I have been meaning to ask for your input on some new strategies. No! Oh, goodness. Only if you think someone as lowly as myself might be of service. Lowly? But of course, I value your skills more highly than most any other. Claude, you say that to everybody. Oh, goodness. Nah, but for real, I think if I had to guess, Ingrid would be one of the elites of the Blue Lions. Okay, time out. Listen, Ingrid, do you really have to say, oh, goodness, every couple of seconds? <laughs> what do you expect? Speaking to me as you were, I only responded in kind. That's true. She did a good job in matching you. What? Do I sound that strange? I thought I was acting earnest and industrious. Claude, that was the complete opposite. I mean, yes, you do. You sound nothing short of ridiculous. Sheesh. Have you looked in a mirror lately? You're the one who's been walking around like queen uptight. Excuse me? I'll admit it was a bit forced, but it certainly doesn't warrant such a title. Uh, look, this was fresh and fun for a while, but uh, maybe it's time we called it quits. Yeah. I think so. Acting like this isn't us. Yep. We're just going to make everyone think we've gone mad. You really will. I agree. I must say, I have an easier time getting on with you when you're you, and all your you-ness. Ingrid? Phrasing? Like, massive phrasing? Come to think of it, you've always been more reliable than most anyone I know, when it really mattered. Huh. <laughs> well... Thanks for saying that. Now there's a genuine compliment. I think I liked you better when you were a bit pricklier too. I've gone so long without hearing one of your lectures, I'm almost starting to miss them. I'm sure I can remedy that for you. Uh, I didn't know really <laughs> you need to go all out or anything. A little restraint would still be nice. My lectures, as you call them, only persist as long as is necessary. Oh, well, I think I'm coming down with a stomach ache. <laughs> we'll talk later, okay? Okay, see ya. You honestly expect me to believe that? Come back here, Claude. Yo, Ingrid. Okay, you know, so I got a interesting comment um, from the villain overhype and on episode the one where Ash died, and he was saying that he thought that I shouldn't recruit everybody because that would ruin the feel of um, of. You know, every, each the next route. Like if I recruit all the Golden Deer members and I didn't end up killing them or something, you know, I ruin it. And what I've been doing this entire time is thinking I was going to have them all in the in the Blue Lions route, so I wouldn't try to do their supports. However, he's got me thinking a bit. Well, I at least think. And plus, I'm starting to like Ingrid's character as well, so I was gonna ban this one, but... And I did Mercedes too, so... Hmm... Rafu was... Oh, shoot! Okay, Ingrid, let's do this. Let's do this. Mm, mm, this me is so good! I wish I could send some home to my little sis. Raphael, what are you doing here? <laughs> oh, I was just enjoying some of this roast. Did you want a bite? No, no. I meant, what are you doing here? This isn't the dining hall. Oh, goodness, she's still the same. <laughs> That's funny. 
Of course I know this isn't the dining hall. You know that, and yet you're stuffing your face here rather than where it's appropriate. But you're not even seated. Is that the best way to eat? If you think so, let's sit down. Ingrid must be like the mom of the group. No, I think that would be, I thought that would be Mercedes. I don't know. It'll be interesting to see their dynamic in their actual house. <sighs> You're missing the point. At least use a plate. I mean, she has a point. You know, like, I understand that's something we do, but, like, we should, you know, use plates and stuff. I don't have a plate with me, so there's nothing I can do about that now. But since when are you so proper, Ingrid? I think always. I'm not proper at all. You're just downright crude. Have you no respect for yourself and your journey to knighthood? Knights must work from the very young age to be upstanding in all facets. You are making a mockery of all that we stand for, you! <laughs> Slow down. I can't do all this listening while I'm trying to eat. Disgusting. <laughs> now you've spilled gravy all over your shoes and your chin. <laughs> you better wipe that up. Nah, Ingrid's great! Um, <laughs> Shoot, I almost wish she was in the... I can't bring her in the actual... I could. She's almost level. Like, I can almost master a master class her. Ooh. Now you need everything to be neat and tidy? You're really particular. This has nothing to do with me. It's what's expected of a knight. Wait. All I have to do is be neat and tidy, and I can become a knight? Forget all that studying, then. I'm just gonna work on being the neatest and tidiest one here. I wait. That that is not what I said. Well, I mean, it's the one way to get him to, you know, work on himself. Oh, really? You're probably right. Don't <laughs> bother with the neat and tidy stuff. Yes, yeah, now look. You are impossible. Yo, Ingrid is great. Ingrid is great. Darn it all! All right, Ingrid. is that the last one? Yeah, that's the last. These are the Golden Deer members. She's close with. <laughs> hey, Ignatz. What are you doing here? Nah, I'm wondering if she's gonna rage again. Uh, hello? Oh, you're painting. Ingrid, what are you doing here? I could ask you the same. I did ask you the same. Anyway, I'm just visiting the cathedral. I must say, that painting is looking wonderful. Ah, uh, don't look, don't look! Why not? It really looks great. Really? I wouldn't lie. Let me have a look. Oh, it's the statue of St. Saros. Oh. I hope you don't think I was ignoring you. When I'm painting, I get totally absorbed. Okay, this definitely should have happened, like, pre-time skip, I feel, because the statue, if it, not, if it was right there, is gone. Of course not. My feelings aren't hurt so easily. Hmm. What if you gave her a more edgy outfit? What? Shorten up her skirt or something. Angry. Whoa. A Angrid. What the heck? No. That would be improper. What the heck? Ooh, and how about making her sword bigger? Oh, oh, turn her into a valiant knight. Okay, hold on. <sighs> I almost wish. No, I, I, no I'm glad I'm seeing this because... All right, Blue Lions, when I start, I already got a favorite. <laughs> Dad, coming, I already got a favorite. But she's not a knight. Aw, oh, come on. Just this once? What in the world? <sighs> huh. She doesn't exactly look like a knight. More like a maniacal demigod. Yeah, I mean, that fits. Yeah, it just kind of came out that way. It's different. Not quite how I envisioned. It's my fault. I should have stuck to my original idea. I'm sorry I pushed you, Ignatz. I'll leave you be. Oh, no, it's cool. Man. Man. Man, oh, man, oh, man. I refuse to get her rank up with A in this route, though. This is the Golden Deers. Speaking of such... Hello, Hilda. Oh, Seth. Good day. Oh, now she's doing it. Is it? <laughs> what do you mean? I, uh, uh, did I do something wrong? Not to my knowledge. But I cannot help but notice that you no longer shy away when I speak to you. <laughs> you noticed that, huh? <laughs> Why is she getting nervous now? When you stare at me, 
I feel like you're peering into my soul. <laughs> and that no longer bothers you? Does that mean your conscience is finally clear? Huh. Nah, I got used to it. Wow. I know you're not scary. Well, that's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Yeah. <laughs> you really should do something to correct your lazy behavior. Maybe that's true. I wouldn't want to be like the fox, forced to wander in the snow all winter. I feel like that's how it was with many people in my Discord. You know, they were being careful at first, but then they got comfortable. And then it's like, nah, we good. We know you're not that scary. And I'm like, darn it all. I'm pleased to see you grasp the moral of the story. Not to say that I can't still deal out punishment when it's due, because I do, but... Don't you think the squirrel was a little cold-hearted, though? He seems not to care about what happens to his friend, as long as he himself is happy. Darn it, Helda. You know, that is a valid point. Yeah. I have no wish to encourage that attitude in children. But darn it all, it was supposed to be a lesson for her. Perhaps if the fox only survives thanks to the squirrel kindly sharing some of his acorns. How does that sound to you? I like it okay. I'm sure that kids will admire that nice, compassionate squirrel. True. Thank you for your insight. As it happens, I have some other stories that I wrote for Flame. Would you like to hear them? You should make a book out of them. It's a shame that only Flane and I get to enjoy them. True. What a fine idea. I will begin immediately. Though I feel such a book requires illustrations, and I have no artistic talent. Would you lend me a hand? Well, you want Ignatz for that. Uh, I think Ignatz might be a better choice, but... Yeah. I can probably manage. Not like they need to be terribly fancy. I could use some more of your wisdom with regard to the content of the stories also. That sounds like a pain, but I'm invested in this now. <laughs> Let's do it. Well, that, that's a plan. Excellent. That's wonderful to hear. Let us produce the very best book we can. For the children's sake. He looks so excited. I can't help but lend a hand. Well, that's good. And now... Do you remember this place? This is where your dagger almost took my nose off. Well, that's a way to start the conversation. Ah, uh, yes. The poisonous spider. You really scared me senseless back then. I thought I was about to die. I would not take a life without reason. Ever since then, I've been intrigued by you. Huh? Somehow, I keep returning to this spot. Claude? For a nap, I'm sure. <laughs> you see right through me, don't you? But it's true that I think about you a lot. What are you gonna do once the war is over? Have you decided on your next place to belong? That's what I asked. I haven't given it much thought. Mm, I think she said the same thing. Will you go back to Dagda? There was no one waiting for me there, and no reason to hurry back. Besides, I've grown accustomed to the nomadic lifestyle. I can make do wherever I find myself. Though, I may be interested in visiting Almira. Whoa! Oh, snap! Almira? That's a bit out of nowhere. It's as far from my homeland as possible. That's reason enough for me. That's not what she's saying. And you? Where will you go? Oh, I haven't decided anything. The way she looked, I never seen her move like that. But if you're heading to Almira, maybe I should pay a visit to Dagda. Why would you do that? Because it's where you grew up. That certainly warrants a look. And once we've both seen our fill, how about we plan to meet back up somewhere in Fodlin? And do what? We can tell each other where we're headed next. Who knows, we might find ourselves belonging in the same place again. Though if we do, I hope it'll turn out to be more permanent than this temporary coincidence. <laughs> we can decide where we belong when we get there. What? Seriously, I've never seen her move like that! True. The future's more fun when you don't know what it holds. I look forward to finding out, Shamir. Well, that is, um... That is interesting. Oh, and I can't forget. Flame. Oh, wait, what the... Wait, did I just... Oh. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna lie. Somebody already did spoil that for me. Wish I had clicked on it I accident earlier. So at least I got that reaction on camera, because when I did find out, I was... 
quite downtrodden, which is always better to get that stuff on camera. Oh, and let me just, well, anybody who it would matter to probably isn't listening at this point. But, uh, if to those of you who are listening, do not tell me stuff about the future of the game. At all. Like, you gotta understand, I am gonna be playing this for, what, about two years? Maybe? Because I still have two more routes to do. Any little thing that you tell me, it's not trivia. Don't think of it as trivia. It's stuff I'm looking forward to, to finding out when I get to that point in the game. Why else would I play through all three routes if I wasn't looking forward to that little change, you know? So, anyways, uh, I guess we just need to transport somewhere. All right, can we get the truth now? What's wrong? Oh, hello, Professor. How nice to see you. You caught me off guard. I was actually just thinking about you. Why the sigh? Just a moment ago? Well, I... I... I, I am afraid I just do not understand you. When we first met, I sensed something different about you. Something mysterious. Mm-hmm. And now I am convinced. Your existence itself is very special. Thinking on it, I know it to be true. You have a crest that should have been lost long ago. You wield the sword of the creator as if it is nothing. I mean, I'm pretty sure Rhea had something to do with that. Your hair and eye color changed on that day five years ago. To the same sort of color as mine and my brother's. Flane, is there something special about your hair you're not telling me? Yes. I do not know. My brother refuses to speak to me of it. Oh, you don't even know. Since then, you have led us into battle, and thus far, we have always come out victorious. Your comrades and colleagues adore you. They believe in you, in your strength. Well, I, to be quite frank, I've gotten lucky so far. I doubt there is a single soul who is likened to you. Who are you, really? I shouldn't sell myself short, though. I've had some pretty nice plans. I don't know. I simply do not understand. That's what I'm hoping Rhea can answer. Whatever the case may be, having hair like mine is proof that there is something exceptional about you. I may as well come forward with things. Oh, please, please. I, too, am unlike others. Flame, if that's all you're gonna give me, how so? Surely you recall when I was targeted, specifically for my blood? Yes. I may not be special in the ways you are, but my blood is rare. How so? It seems the two of us share a special... differentness. Flame, I could have put that together. I also believe that we are bound together in some way. Of this, I am certain. Therefore, I intend to stay by your side and watch over you. Your existence must be preserved at all cost. I would rather protect you. Certainly those are the words of a hero. No, like literally I've been trying to make sure you've been safe this entire time. Let us unite our powers. Together, we are unstoppable. And between me and you, Flane, I think I might be really counting on you in this next battle. I have a crazy plan that may or may not pay off, but you're key to it. We'll see. All right. Well, that now gives the option. So that is Lysithia is not even active. Why her? What is so special? Is it because we need to find out her past? That's the only thing I can think of. And that the, if that's the case, I have to really make sure, like, if I'm being honest, you know, it would have really hurt to lose people. It's like there's a curve of how much it would hurt to lose my students, right? Because, well, I want to know their story. I want to know who they were, you know, and I guess for a YouTube standpoint, right? It's like if I had lost one of them long before we got to this point, then that would have been you know that would have been horrible it'd been something i've been sad about through the entire playthrough and you know it i legitimately might have not been the same and not as excited thinking all this time i miss something i miss something i miss something i i miss something but 
that hasn't been the case. Well, I mean, well, there actually is one. And I guess now I can go ahead and say what I'm thinking. Petra. Petra, Petra, Petra. She is my one regret because I cannot, or my biggest regret, right? Ferdinand and um, Sylvain are also big regrets, but from what I gather, okay, if I'm being honest about the stuff people have told me and I've been trying to ignore and not read the comments fully, I get a strong feeling Hilda's recruitable in another route. Do not tell me, I am, that's what I'm trying to tell people, don't tell me stuff. That would have been very surprising to find out. Anyways, um, and if I had to guess, it's probably the Blue Lions. Just, just gonna throw that out there. So, what I'm thinking, I'm hoping in this next battle that maybe Dimitri will join our ranks. Maybe if we talk to him. And I'm also hoping if, if she's there, I might be able to save Petra. Why is that? Well, I'll say next battle, if it happens, if she's there. Um, and I know I'll have recorded that when this comes out because, well, some people, they, you've, you, you slip up, all right? Be honest, you slipped up before. So, and while I do have the admins, you know, they do have lives, so there's always a chance something could happen. Anyways. The point is that I'm not I'm going to try to save Petra in the next battle if she is there. If she's not, because Petra, I remember her reasoning. She said that she owed somebody in the Empire a favor. I remember that. She doesn't seem as loyal to the Empire as the others would be. So perhaps I can still get her. It all depends, like, if she's, like, other war, I don't know how I'd run into Petra otherwise, because I don't know how to show the calendar, or the map of the world, but I'm pretty sure Bridget is far from the Alliance. We wouldn't even run into it normally, uh, because we might have to deal with Almira, or, like, I just feel like running into Petra, it, I feel like if we were to do it, it'd be, ne it'd be next battle. I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. But anyways, it's gonna be something I try. And it's it's my birth month. Like, if that works out, I'm either gonna be if she's there, I'm either gonna be really like I haven't spoken about her because I've been keeping it quiet. But if she is there and I have to kill her, that is, it, I'm either gonna be really happy or really upset. And some of you have already played the game, you probably already know which one. Those of you who don't know the game, we'll find out together next episode, I guess. Alright, with that said, let's do some housekeeping. A speed carrot! Man, I am liking that. all this stuff we get. As far as myself, would I, if I like to work on something... Um, yeah, if I can get my reason up, that'd be great. All right, got a great. Ooh, maybe I can. Lysithia? C plus. Oh. There is still more to learn. Okay. Hmm, well, only thing else I could think of is... Authority, I mean, I'll get that eventually. Faith, I'm not gonna make it. Sword, I'm not gonna make it. I don't know. Uh, I'll do healing, I guess. Faith. Let's see if we can get that up. Maybe. A little bit more. I need five more people. And I don't even know if I have enough people to just do that. Or to just who specialize in uh, faith to begin with. So, I guess I'll work on sword training then. 
Or how's my bow? Man, actually my bow is closer. Let's do that. Okay, got a great. Good. And a great. All right. Well, with that, there's no reason to stay here, right? Yeah, because I don't want to give any gifts or things like that. Actually. Hello there. This one, yes? How many smithing stones and black steel do I have? Return soon, please. 28, 21. Oh, that's really good, actually. All right, let's end it. Grander Field should be around here, right? Yeah. It's so foggy. Even if there were enemies here, we'd never know it. Oh, shoot. I recall the terrain from the Battle of the Eagle and Lion, but without the ability to see the enemy's formation... You gotta be kidding me. I won't know who I'm fighting until I can... No. Our enemies are subject to the same conditions. We'll just have to wait for the fog to clear up. Darn it. Speaking of enemies, what do you think became of those unidentified troops? Any follow-up reports? We haven't heard anything since. If they were headed this way... Well, I'd like to avoid being caught by surprise, but we can't make use of our scouts because of this fog. Please tell me the actual map will have fog. It's hard to predict this fight. There's no way to know what will happen. Yeah. Let's try to stay calm. Of course. The morale of our allies would be crushed if we let them see us shaking in our boots. Yeah. Your guidance is going to be crucial, teacher. I know. Now more than ever. I know. Do whatever it takes to lead us to victory. Oh man, so much for the plan. I, I thought, shoot. Fog. And we know how I dealt with fog. Okay, well, let me just, before Eddie been, no, I should, I should wait. I don't know if the actual map will have fog. It's highly likely that it will, but until I see it, I shouldn't make hasty decisions like that. All I need to do is forge, repair my weapons if need be. Nothing else. Nothing else. Wow. I could try another... See, no, I can't. I'm out. I'm out of Master Seals. I literally can't. Alright. Well. I do want to do one last thing then. I remembered this. Sacred Power. Speed plus two. Yeah, I already have it equipped. I realized that I killed Ash and Ferdinand. And i pretty sure I had more speed than both of them. I could have stolen their Master Seals, as cruel as that seems. I gotta be realistic. Okay. Shoot, man. I will, I'll find out what happens next time. We got some fog. Alright, well, until then, this has been Blade. Thank you all so much for watching, and I am not looking forward to what's gonna happen next time. And now it is time for the question of the day. And we have two fronts. You have the amazing support combos, in my opinion, which I got from Ingrid. And that's actually the question of the day. Let's just get that out of the way. Uh, what was your favorite support from this episode? I know I asked this a lot, but, you know, I'm often just curious. Because to me, there were a lot of good ones. You had Hilda and Seta and all of Ingrid's. Uh, there, were just, there were just so many. Um, and then the end the end um that is all i'm going to say so with that said please post your thoughts down in the comments below about this one and i tried to make it faster um most people seem like they w were okay with having it be an hour long because like i can tell like I, not only that you guys probably want to see next episode i wanted to hurry up and get this episode done 
Uh, cause if I just, I could have split it into two episodes, but the first part was kind of just me, you know, grinding and stuff. So I figured why not just make it one episode and we can get t- moving along with the story. Cause I also feel like that kind of hurt the series in a sense, because not just with my breaks, but also if I was taking long to get to the next part of the story. So with that said, again, post your thoughts down in the comments below and I will see you all next time.